Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Oxen Free. So last time we checked out, you know, Clarissa freaked out on us. Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. Calm down, Jonas. Alright, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos, yeah. I'm sure this is just the end. it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave. Just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But won't it be, like, locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself? Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's, that's going a little above, above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. Yeah, but that's, like, scary. Well, something better work. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry, this is like, this looks like the end, but from the, from the wrong film thing. No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See? It says, when someone sends an emergency signal from the catbird station in the woods, and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. Brilliant! Really? It's good enough for me. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Can we just... I mean... Can we just, like, think this plan through for, like, one minute before running off half-cocked? That was not the response. <laughs> Everyone heard that, right? Don't we need, like, access codes or something like that? Actually, I doubt it. It'll probably be tied to, like, the military radios and, well, we stole them, so. Well, the huh. system works. All right, screw it. We're doing it. All right, so we're going all the way up to, uh, where we were before in the all right. Break. And if anything goes wrong, please, don't tell me. I won't want to know. Well, now I'm going to run over there and specifically tell you at the first drop of bad news. No! Alright, so as I was trying to say before, welcome back. Uh, Clarissa was possessed by the ghosts again. Turns out Maggie had a friend who apparently died. So that's a thing. But yeah, so we're going to go to the woods, do the call and response, and, you know, set up hopefully our way out of here. Back to Epiphany Fields. And you go. Thank you. I was like, standing there thinking, I'm like, okay, is it gonna go anytime soon or what? All right, now it's just me and Jonas. Oh God, not again. Whoa, okay. See, I know the thing about Ben drowned, but this is Ren drowned. Alex, Alex, okay, are you, are you back to normal? I just saw, it, it, it was like a premonition, I think. And I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that. Cause I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I can't let that matter right now. Ren, look, I just know he needs me. I mean, me seeing him in trouble must mean he's like actually in trouble, right? Not really, I think it's just an effect of the uh, possession or something. <laughs> no, look, it kind of made sense. Okay, hey, so he's guys. fine. Uh, wait, 
Did I get the plan wrong? Because if I got it right... No, you didn't get it wrong. I saw... I saw Ren drowning in a... The only way to describe it is it was like a vision or something. What? Seriously? Alex got possessed for a minute there. And yes, it was scary, but it was just a hallucination triggered by ghosts rummaging around through her brain. No big deal. I mean, they're clearly fine. Well, wait. Okay, I guess they're fine. For them. What does- Okay, well, it's been fun catching up, kids. We'll go do our half of the fix the ghost problem equation now. All right. See you after, at the bomb shelter. Yeah, so hopefully I set those two up together the right way. I think I did. Alright, that's the Milner outpost. That's Harden Tower over there. I would love to go back to the comm tower, but it has nothing to do with what we're doing. We need to actually go here to the Tui Woods. You know what time it is? It's four in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually in uh, that situation? Uh, pizza. Never leave pizza on the table. It's like Hell getting 11 yeah. in blackjack. Just double down. Don't even think about it. You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. It is all we have, yeah. I just... I just wish I felt like the ghosts hmm. were concerned that their plan won't work. I just feel like they're pretty confident. Like, they know by sunrise they're all gonna be shopping you for know school what? supplies. Yeah, well, you know who else was confident? Hitler. And look how Oof. he ended up. Dead. With syphilis. Oh, Damn. True. <laughs> I think this um, stuff is getting pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Um, yeah. It's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Yeah. Things are getting pulled in from another reality. That never seems good. Good. Where are we supposed to be going? It's the wrong button. I gotta go up the bridge stand and use the bomb shelter. Okay. Come on, buddy. You good? Yeah, you good. I did not mean to press that button. I keep pressing shift thinking I'm gonna run. Not how that works. Now the station's right. up at the top of the hill. Up we go, <sighs> boys. I hope this works. Me too. Because if it doesn't, we're a bit out of luck. Top of the hill. Top of the hill. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this what? works. <sighs> God, we're in another loop de loo They always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? <sighs> yeah, they do. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, uh, I am great. also hope that. I am also hope that. Let me see if it'll do it again. I guess I can't go that way. Go that way. Guess I'm going down here. Ren! No, no, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren. What the he's, hell? He had an accident. He. He died. I couldn't. He hit a rock. No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Alex. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry, Nona. It's the truth, I though. Didn't mean anything. What happened? 
He he drowned. That's new. He took a fall. That's the other one we saw. I don't know. He just he just stopped. Where is he? I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either oh, way, you asked. Done is done. I know you're not Jonas, so there's no use in pretending. Soon it won't be a pretense. It'll be an absolute. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Um, a proposition? Like what? It's already over with Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss, you won't slaughter the rest of your friends. Like young Reginald here. We need to No, no way. I'm saving everyone. Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. Uh, courage is not always the way, dear. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? We're getting out of here. All of us. Run too. <laughs> okay. We know because we can be Jonas for this long. And his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we did intend to provide you all the rules. Alright, ghost. Get out of my friend's body, please. Thank you. Great. Now Jonas is gone. Again. I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just. It's okay, Nona. You, you didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course, it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm hey. sorry. It's, I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is... He was more important. No, no, really. Ren would be flattered to hear you say anything about him. So if he can hear this at all, trust me, he's over the moon right now. Sure. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. Hey, we got it. And I don't know if he did. He knew, Nona. Don't worry. He knew. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. But thanks, Alex. And he didn't know. He hoped. There we go. The station's up at the top of the. Ugh. God, that was... My mouth Not feels fun. like I just ate a tree. You were possessed. And for the longest time, I think that we've um, seen so far. Yeah, I know. I can kind of remember that part. Hello? Anyone there? What? Are they... Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? Anybody? Jonas? I'm alive. <gasps> that's all I got. Jonas, care. punch Alex if you can hear this. Yeah, no, that's a, that's a bonus too. Seriously, right in the throat. Jonas, don't listen. We're all set here for the, uh, the thing? The machinery speak and hug or whatever we're doing? Call yeah, let's response. do it. Time's wasted. Like, actually wasted. Like, I feel my body wasting away. No, it's it's okay if you're, like, dealing with stuff. I'm trying we to get in the damn stuff. door. What stuff? I'm just curious to see what they say. When I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh, oh sweet God, Jesus, so she fell. No, it was the... It was psychotic to watch. Like, almost doesn't quite describe the terror that held my heart watching her come closer. It wasn't that. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like 5,000 feet up. It wasn't that high. Aww. It was like, it was high. Believe me. Hello. We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? 
If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Oh, thank God. I'd like to report a poltergeist. They've come into my house. They've shaved all my cats. They look better in my mittens. Oh, I just need any and all advice you can give me. Well, first... Everyone just shut up. You can play dress-up phone time when you get home. Yeah, I guess he's right, actually. Okay, oh, come right. on. Fine. We kind of need to have a little bit of fun. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and now. Alright. Time to cl close the time hole and save the day. Alright, so we're off to go close the time hole, boy and girls. Why did I say boy and girls? Jesus. I might, at some point, do a, like, a speed run of the game just to get all the anomalies. Or maybe not. I mean, the game's kind of old. You know, all the anomalies are actually out there and they're listed. But it's an interesting story. You know what? Actually, no, I won't do it. I'll just talk about them in the next episode. I'll go through the entire list. And, yeah. It'll, it'll reveal a lot more of the story to this actual series. Oh, series, I say, but it's just one game. And one inter interesting augmented reality Discord server. <laughs> Come on, Jonas. Jonas. Get up here, Jonas. Don't be stupid, Jonas. But, yeah. Oh, on the fun side, uh, my computer should be built early August. It's just gonna be a lot more expensive than I thought. Like, I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Oh, great. Couldn't we have him reborn? Oh, no. Come on, Jonas. Don't turn freaky now. Okay, okay, okay. I'm... Jesus Christ. I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... Are you okay now? Really? Yeah, I think. It's just, um... Uh... Look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like, just, like, how do I say this, cuz... It's okay, Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. I just want to say, I just, I think it would have been cool, us living together for, for whatever, senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. I'm just glad we met. <laughs> I'm glad, too, okay? So, there. It's out in the open. We're both glad. Okay, good. So, that's it. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. And we're gonna be fine, by the way. There's no... You don't have to put it like it would have been whatever to live together. We are gonna live together, and you're someday soon gonna eat all the peanut butter, and when I go make a sandwich, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> all right. Jonas is a good brother. He's a bit weird, but, you know, he doesn't know her yet. It takes time. You know, that's a thing. But yeah, I don't know if I—I I think I mentioned that it's gonna take me a little bit longer to build the computer than I expected, so maybe mid-August. But yeah, if all goes well, August I'll have the new computer boy built, and then it's gonna be powerful, and I'll never have to worry about you know upgrading my computer again for like another seven to ten years. It'll be really fun. Oh God, it's five a.m. We have till dawn. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight. But. You know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's what? not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash... Oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, because whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. I don't really care about the reasons, just for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. Wow, big man on campus, I don't know why I said that. Big step, that's what I mean. Big step. Eh, it's not a big deal. I'm just letting you know, so... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. I just wanted to tell you. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. 
This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Really? Oof. Why leave? I mean, yeah, it can suck sometimes, but it's pretty much like everywhere else. This is gonna sound weird, but everybody knows me here. I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. Just don't put so much pressure on yourself, Michael. Who I cares really, what they think? Way you're too gonna, hard to that, Michael. You're gonna do what you're gonna do. I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. Yes, I will. Uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Oh my, how profound. I can't believe Uncle Pete's a mere failed actor and not teaching philosophy at Berkeley. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Michael, Auto. Don't I mean, be that Jonas is right too now. funny. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Whoa, okay, we're back, I think, maybe. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. All right, well, let's go. Talk to the boy and girl down there and see if they're a couple. Please be a couple, please be a couple. I swear if I screwed this up, I'm gonna be mad. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's just like a trial period. Like, buying a used car that I can already tell is missing a lot. Hey, what? damn. Secret secrets <laughs> aren't fun unless you share with everyone. What is it? Reveal yourselves. We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I, we're gonna date. Really? Hey. Dude, what did you just say? <laughs> what? They asked. Right? You asked? Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. No, stop. It's one day at the Revival Theater. We're just going to sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Romantic. Hey, one man's depressant is another chick's upper. Aw, how cute. Riviera is a great movie house. And the ushers can't tell where you're putting your hands if you sit in row G, by the way. Please don't tell him that. Anyways, <laughs> I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I mean. Okay, well, I'm happy for you, but we still have the little issue of submarine ghosts to, um, exercise. Yeah, that thing. I... I want to get this off my chest. Just something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghosts or whatever, but you've been acting like not you. Ren. No, I just... Well, I'm sorry. I don't... I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but can we, like, so this is pretty much where it confirms why? if you, like... I don't know. In case things hurt go bad Ren too and much to be friends yeah, afterwards or it. stuff like that. We're on a beach. So clearly, kind I didn't, of, you know, a shred of normal here. Make it that great for Ren. All right, let's take it. But clearly, Alex, I got them together, so I feel good. You know, Ren You're was being childish. You're not getting out of it. <sighs> All right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So, make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside convenient point to note so with that in mind i'm gonna stop the episode here for today we will finish this next time or actually 
No, we're not gonna finish it next time. What we're gonna do next time is actually go through all the anomalies. I thought I was gonna be like, oh, you know, we'll just do the finale next episode, hurdy dur. Nah, 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 nah. Now we got an excuse to do all the anomalies. There's ten more that I gotta find, and then I will do the finale. But other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play Oxen Free. If you like today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think about the space submarine ghosts. Radio, wait, radioactive space ghost demon things that we got going on and yeah you just let me know what you think if you aren't already subscribed go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell join the curly crew that way you already know whenever i drop a brand new episode leave a comment down below and i will catch you all here next time hope you all have a great and wonderful day everyone <laughs>